What if I told you that some trucks are built to last a million miles, while others barely make it past 100,000? What separates the legends of the road from the ones that break down before they even get a chance to prove themselves? It's not just luck. There are key factors, some obvious, some surprising, that determine whether a truck will keep running strong for decades or end up in the scrapyard way too soon. Let's start with one of the biggest factors, how the truck is built in the first place. Not all trucks are created equal. Some are built with longevity in mind, while others are designed to be as cheap and lightweight as possible. And that difference becomes painfully obvious after a few hundred thousand miles. Look at legendary long haul trucks like the Peterbilt 379. Kenworth W900 or Volvo VNL. These trucks have been known to hit a million miles with the right care. But why? It all comes down to the materials and components used. A million mile truck starts with a strong reinforced frame, high quality steel chassis, thicker cross members, and durable suspension components all help reduce stress on the truck over time. If the foundation is weak, the entire truck is at risk of cracking, flexing too much, or wearing out faster than expected. Then there's the engine. Certain engines are simply built to last longer. Classic examples like the Cummins N14, Detroit Diesel Series 60, and Caterpillar 3406E have a reputation for running forever when properly maintained. These engines were designed in an era where durability mattered more than squeezing out a few extra miles per gallon. Large displacement, low RPM diesel engines tend to last longer because they don't have to work as hard to generate power. On the other hand, more modern engines are often tuned for fuel efficiency and emissions regulations, which sometimes means higher stress on internal components. That's why some modern trucks, despite all their advanced technology, don't hold up as well over the long haul. But engine choice alone isn't the full story. You could have the best engineered truck in the world, but if it's neglected, it won't last. Maintenance is what separates the trucks that barely limp past 300,000 miles from the ones that roll past a million like it's nothing. Oil changes are obvious, but it's not just about changing the oil, it's about using the right oil. Running cheap, low-quality oil or stretching service intervals too long accelerates wear on critical engine components. High mileage trucks that survive often use premium synthetic oils and stick to a strict maintenance schedule. Cooling systems are another big one. Overheating is a silent truck killer. If the radiator isn't flushed, if the coolant is neglected, or if hoses and water pumps aren't replaced when needed, a truck that could have lasted a million miles might end up with a blown engine long before that. Transmission maintenance is another often overlooked factor, whether it's an Eaton Fuller manual or an automated manual transmission. Fluid changes and clutch adjustments make a massive difference in how long a transmission lasts. A neglected transmission can fail before the engine even gets a chance to show its true potential. The same goes for axles and differentials. Long haul trucks put incredible stress on these components. And if gear oil isn't changed or bearings aren't inspected, failure is inevitable. And when a differential fails at highway speeds, it's not just expensive, it's catastrophic. But even if a truck is perfectly maintained, there's another factor that determines how long it will last. A truck's lifespan isn't just about what's under the hood, it's also about how it's driven. The most durable engine in the world won't last if it's constantly abused. Take two identical trucks. One is driven by an experienced trucker who knows how to manage RPMs, avoid excessive idling, and ease into acceleration. The other is driven hard, rev too high, constantly stopping and starting, and rarely given time to warm up properly. One of those trucks is making it to a million miles. The other, not so much. Long haul highway miles are far easier on a truck than constant stop and go driving. That's why some old highway trucks rack up over a million miles with relatively few issues, while city delivery trucks that stop every few blocks wear out much faster. 
And then there's the weight factor. A truck that's constantly running at maximum payload is under more stress than one that carries lighter loads. More stress means more wear on the engine, transmission, brakes, and suspension. Over time, that adds up. Even idling plays a role. Many trucks spend hours idling, especially in extreme weather, but excessive idling wears out an engine faster than running it under load. That's why some fleet operators use auxiliary power units APUs, to keep drivers comfortable without putting unnecessary hours on the main engine. Modern trucks are packed with technology, advanced emission systems, automated transmissions, and computerized diagnostics have changed how trucks operate. But are they helping trucks last longer or just adding more points of failure? One of the biggest issues in modern trucks is emissions-related equipment. Diesel particulate filters, DPFs, exhaust gas recirculation, EGR systems, and selective catalytic reduction, SCR, all help reduce emissions but they also introduce additional maintenance challenges. Clogged DPFs, EGR failures, and DEF system malfunctions can sideline a truck far sooner than a pre-emissions model. At the same time, modern diagnostics and telematics can help extend a truck's life by catching issues early. Fleet managers can track real-time engine data, predict maintenance needs, and avoid breakdowns before they happen. So, while modern trucks may have more complex systems, they also offer more tools to keep them running. So, is it possible for a truck to last forever? Technically, yes. If you replace enough parts, some trucks get a full engine rebuild after a million miles, extending their life even further. Others go through multiple transmissions, differentials, and suspension overhauls to stay on the road. But the reality is, even the toughest trucks have a limit. At some point, the cost of maintaining an old truck outweighs the benefits of keeping it running. That's why even the most legendary million-mile trucks eventually retire. But here's the thing. If you know what to look for and you take care of a truck the right way, you can push it far beyond what most people think is possible. Whether you're driving a brand new rig or an old-school classic, the key to making it last is understanding what makes the difference. A million-mile truck isn't just about luck. It's about smart engineering, careful driving, and relentless maintenance. So the next time you see a truck rolling down the highway with an odometer that's maxed out, remember, it didn't get there by accident. What do you think? Have you ever driven a truck that made it to a million miles? What's the highest mileage you've ever seen on a rig? Let us know in the comments. And if you enjoyed this deep dive into the world of high mileage trucks, make sure to like and subscribe for more videos just like this. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next run.